Ty and Patty Warnish are taking their newborn to see the pediatrician for the first time. He made his entrance into the world inside of his parents' Jeep as his mom's contractions went into overdrive Saturday afternoon. I just told him, you know, I can feel him. He's coming. He's coming. And he kept mm. telling me, no, he's not. Stop. Just <laughs> calm down. Calm down. And I thought she was being a little bit dramatic, but uh, boy, was I wrong. So very calm in these pictures. This baby had no idea his father was running red lights and doing 90 to get him from Stockdale to the hospital in Seguin. And dad was also coaching mom at the same time. Ty actually was driving with one hand on the steering wheel, the other hand helping me try to get him coming out. The peaceful pictures of the Warnish family just don't describe the intensity of mom with her feet on the dashboard. Both parents in delivery mode on the road with no emergency assistance. You gotta pull him out, you got one big push and... And I pulled him out by his shoulders and put him straight to my chest and he was, he screamed right away. Six pounds, 15 ounces. Tabor Don Warnish, born inside of a Jeep en route to the hospital, to his parents' joy. Laughing and smiling immediately after she put him on the chest. And she's like, it was the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Coronavirus restrictions couldn't keep loved ones from taking a peek through a hospital window to see baby Tabor. You know, entrances take energy. Even though it was not planned, we would not change how it happened now yeah, looking back. Very special to us. Now there's a big sign in front of the Warnish home for Stockdale's newest parents. I think <laughs> we're gonna sit down and watch a Talladega Nights and show them how Ricky Bobby was born. And <laughs> <laughs> Marvin Hurst, Ken Spy, uh, Eyewitness News. No, I, I just, I think, I think he's gonna have a story to tell the rest of his life. And I think,